Okay, we're here today to uh, do a rock experiment, and you might get a sheet like this from your teacher uh, with uh, five rocks listed. You can use these rocks or uh, other rocks that you might have at your home with your family's permission, of course. We're going to put these rocks in small containers that have some vinegar that you can buy in any grocery store uh, in it and we're going to see if they fizz because we're looking for calcite. So over here I have my containers uh, and uh, my rocks. I have them labeled. Uh, this first one here is sandstone. And one at a time, we're just gonna very gently put them down into the vinegar. And then limestone is next. And then we have shale. Next is a seashell, and then coal is the last one that we have here. And we're gonna let these sit for just a couple of minutes, and then we're gonna come back and see if we uh, notice any bubbles. Okay, so it's been a few minutes, and we are back to check on our rocks. So if we look at the sandstone, we don't really see any bubbles coming out of that. When you look at the limestone, notice all those little bubbles in there. Um, while you're doing this, don't stand directly over the vinegar. Um, you don't want to breathe that in. It smells yucky and it might not make you feel so well. So stand back um, and just take a glance uh, into your jars when you're looking at them at home. Uh, and you can see ooh, a big bubble there came up out um, from the limestone. So there's definitely calcite there. But in the shale, I don't see any bubbles in that. So no calcite in the shale. Next we have the seashell. Um, in the seashell, we have lots of bubbles again. And that's because limestone is made from seashells and the calcite in limestone actually came from seashells. That's why uh, limestone forms caves and other rocks do not. And then we have our coal. Here is our last uh, experiment. Um, so take a look at those. If you want to let them sit for a few days, as I said, put them someplace where it's ventilated, where you're not gonna breathe the vinegar. Um, but if they sit for about a week or so, you might come back. You'll see lots of stuff has come out of the gravel there. The gra It's now a lot smaller than it was before. And there are some little crystals forming on the side of the cup above the vinegar. It's even more dramatic when we look here at the seashell that I left sit for about a week. You can actually see some little crystals forming on the seashell. Um, so almost like some little stalactites and stalagmites growing up from the calcite that dissolved in the vinegar um, on the seashell there. Well, I hope you enjoyed this experiment. Let us know if you have any questions or comments and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Thank you.